Hello Gothamites and welcome to the Gotham Knight channel. I am your host the Gotham Knight and I hope you're having a wonderful day out in Gotham City today and uh, today's bit of news is uh, well I, I did not see this coming and I know a lot of us are going to have a lot of fun with it and it is purely the, the time that we're living in now for for being a Batman fan is just amazing just simply amazing and all right so let's get on with today's news we learn uh today um through various articles uh and this one i'm gonna go ahead and use is uh from uh games radar but we learned a former batman movie star is coming back to write a comic yes so Without further ado, let's go ahead and introduce Danny DeVito. That's right. Danny DeVito is coming back to write a Penguin story. Now, I'm going to go ahead and read the whole article for you. And this will be coming out for a very special uh, one-shot uh, comic book that will be coming out this fall. Okay? And the comic book is called Gotham City Villains Anniversary. Uh, it's a giant anniversary uh, edition, number one. And I, I love villains. If you know me, I love the villains. I love every villain from Batman. And uh, let's go ahead and get started. And let's go ahead and read this article here, okay? So as the article reads, Danny DeVito writing a Penguin comic for the Batman villain's 80th anniversary. That's right. Batman is turning 80. Let's close these little windows. Um, 1992's Batman Returns has become a cult classic largely on the strength of its villains, including actor Danny DeVito's whole cloth transformation into the Penguin. Now, DeVito is reprising the role in a somewhat unique writing a Penguin-centric comic book story for November's Gotham City Villains, Anniversary Giant No. 1 Anthology One-Shot. So, uh, DeVito's monstrous, ruthless depiction of the Penguin redefined the character in public in conscience from uh, being a dapper, dastardly crime boss to a bloodthirsty, bird-like mastermind. Uh, so, I'm not going to go ahead and read the whole article, but it, it is right there. And seeing this was very surprising. I had no idea that uh Danny DeVito was going to do this. No, of course uh Danny has had some great success especially with um uh was always like uh always sunny in Philadelphia. So DeVito Danny DeVito the artist hasn't been uh named for this and I'm wondering who is the artist. Uh we'd love to get them on the show to talk about this. Uh, but it is coming out on November 30th and, uh, what has been going on also is a lot of, uh, comic book websites are out there telling us how the Batman titles are just dominating for this fall. What well, you have to also keep in mind that we are also doing a big build up to the Batman movie and everything that's coming out in in the in the batman universe of course so all this news that is coming out and uh simply putting out there for for us to enjoy really as batman fans is just amazing i'm very interested to see what danny is going to write and if he's going to be doing his penguin is he doing a whole another take on penguin I'm pretty sure a lot of us want to see his penguin continue on, uh, see what what may be there. Um, we all love Tim Burton, especially with all the news that is coming out. And and hopefully with uh, with Michael Keaton talking about that, he is talking to Tim Burton. Um, one of the comments that did come out was very, did remind me that uh, Michael Keaton and Tim Burton have been talking about Beetlejuice too. And that could be in development. Uh, what I've also heard uh, plenty of times through the years is that um, Tim Burton always wanted another shot at Batman. 
and doing something else that he had wanted to do. So hopefully that comes into fruition. But it, this is this is very interesting because now Danny is technically back in the fold. And now with Danny seeing Keaton back, could there be something there? Now we know the, the penguin uh, technically passed away in Batman Returns. But is there something there? And I'm going to say was a, a very, if you're a Disney fan, you're going to love this. But maybe there's something there that we've never seen before. And that could lead into, hey, high speculation. And this is the fun. This is what we get to talk. This is comic book shop talk, right? And could we see a return to that? There have also been reports that Michelle Pfeiffer was rumored to come out in The Flash. Though it's not been talked about, but that's technically who Michael Keaton's Bruce Wayne married. So, could it be a, a return to yesteryear? Um, well, yesteryear being 89 and 92. It's a great time to be a, a Burtonverse fan. I am all for this. I, I love it. I, I'm enjoying it. Um, but let me know your thoughts. Let me know your thoughts on uh, Danny DeVito coming back. And, uh, you know, what are you hoping to see? I, I can't wait to see this. We're going to go ahead and do a review of this. I just can't wait. So, all right, Gotham Mites, I'm going to go ahead and get on out of here. And I want you guys to have a wonderful day out in Gotham City. Take care.